we were down at the Texas High School Football Hall of Fame uh, induction ceremony this weekend, um, talking up the candidates and having a good time down there in Waco, Texas. And one of the guys we ran into is the 10th winningest coach in Texas high school football history. Spent 45 years at Buda Hayes. Was it 45 or was it 43? Seven. Okay. He, he's coached for 47 years. 40, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Total. Okay. Yeah. He spent like a couple of them at, you Bute, say in the at video. Buda High. Yeah, I say it in, in the interview. Uh, but he spent more than 40, 40 years at Buda Hayes High School. Uh, Hayes yeah. Consolidated High School in Buda. Uh, it's Coach Bob Shelton. We had a great conversation with Coach Shelton. Here's our conversation with new Texas High School Football Hall of Famer Bob Shelton here on Texas Football Today. Greg Tepper of Dave Campbell's Texas Football and TexasFootball.com here at the Texas High School Football Hall of Fame induction ceremony here in Waco, Texas uh, with one of the most legendary coaches in Texas high school football history going in the Hall of Fame this year. It's Coach Bob Shelton. Coach, uh, congratulations. What, is, uh, what does it mean to you to be going in the Texas High School Football Hall of Fame? Well, it's uh, kind of an ultimate honor for me. I, I felt like when I retired in 2010, all the honors had passed me by. So this is a, a unexpected victory for me and a re really a tribute to all our coaches and players that we've had over the years. Uh, you've, you've one of the winningest coaches in Texas high school football history. Uh, I'm, I'm interested, is there one win that you value above all others? Is there one win that, that when you think about your career that, that stands out to you? Well, I, I remember all of them. <laughs> <laughs> they, but uh, in uh, 1996, we beat Texas City, who had uh, – Four guys signed with the University of Texas, so that was pretty special to beat them. Uh, not only to win that game at uh, Kyle Field, but it got us to the state finals. So that was pretty impressive for me. You spent uh, 47 years in the coaching profession, all in the city of Buda, uh, with uh, uh, you know, f four with uh, with Buda High School, and then uh, and then 43 with Hayes. Uh, what did it mean to you to to just be able to to spend your entire career in one place in one community? What what did that mean to you? Well, looking back on it, it's very special uh, because I mainly because I met a lot of good people and I get to see them again regularly which if I hadn't been there all those years, I, that wouldn't happen. So it's, it's certainly not something that I planned for, but it's very special to do that. All right, and i got to ask you, Coach, after spending 47 years on the sideline, what are Friday nights like for you now? Are they more stressful? Or are they less stressful? Uh, when, on a Friday night, what, what's that like for you? Well, it's a lot less stressful. <laughs> uh, the good thing about retirement is you don't lose football but you get to do the things you enjoy about the game. And right now I'm enjoying watching my grandson play. Uh, he'll be a senior at Hayes this year, and I can uh, go watch him play and go home and go to sleep. That sounds like a plan. Coach, congratulations. Good to see you. There is Bob Shelton, new Texas high school football Hall of Famer, long overdue. Coach for 47 years. 47 years. Pretty good. And uh, and especially to stick at one school for for that long, pretty cool. Um, is is a great situation for him, and and, and I know he's enjoying retirement uh, there. But uh, I bet he misses the sideline a bit too. But great talking with Coach Shelton at the Texas High School Football Hall of Fame induction ceremony this weekend.